Hi, in this video I'll be showing you how to create the graph of y equals the absolute value of 2x minus 1. Now, in order to create this graph, we must first create the graph of y equals 2x minus 1. We should know that the graph y equals 2x minus 1 is a line because y equals 2x minus 1 is of the form y equals mx plus a constant. Now, what happens when y is equal to 0 in this equation? Well, 2x minus 1 is equal to 0. So 2x equals 1. Therefore, x is a half. So, we know that this line, y equals 2x minus 1, goes through a half 0. That is the coordinate a half 0. Now, what happens when x is 0 in this equation? Well, y equals minus 1. So, we know that the line y equals 2x minus 1 will go through the coordinate 0 minus 1. Now, let's strike a line through these two coordinates that we have put down here. So, the line y equals 2x minus 1 would look like this on a graph. Okay, the question now becomes how do we draw the graph of y equals the absolute value of 2x minus 1? Well, first of all, we must know that if y equals the absolute value of 2x minus 1, then y is greater or equal to 0. That is because the absolute value of n is equal or greater than 0. So we know that a line will not exist underneath y equals 0. So what I'm going to do is put the point half 0 over here. And what I'm also going to do is figure out what y is when x is 0. So when x is 0, y equals the absolute value of 2 multiplied by 0 minus 1, which equals the absolute value of minus 1, which equals 1. So when x is 0, y is now 1. So we're going to put the point 0, 1 over here. Now, this is what the graph of y equals the absolute value of 2x minus 1 would look like. So you put a line going towards half 0 down on this graph, and then you reflect this arm over here from y equals 2x minus 1 so that it goes in an upwards direction. So a new line will be formed and it will be going through the coordinate 0, 1. So the graph of y equals the absolute value of 2x minus 1 should look like this. Now let's see if this is really the case on this graphing program over here. So we've got the graph of y equals the absolute value of 2x minus 1. So you can see that this line over here goes through 0, 1. And you can see that this line over here touches, let me see, half 0, the coordinate half 0. 
Okay, so you can see that my graph here isn't entirely accurate, but I've given you an example of how to draw the graph of y equals the absolute value of 2x minus 1. If you have any questions regarding this video, please leave your comments below. Thank you for watching.